When you first move into an apartment, everything is nice and pristine. You try to keep it as good as the day you moved in, but life happens. As you live in the apartment for longer, the place begins to look lived in. While you were careful about maintaining clutter before, you have become more laxed about it. Welcome to Jensen's DIY. In this video, we will discuss 25 super inventive storage ideas to declutter your apartment. 1. If you have children, then you know they can make a mess. Oftentimes, their toys end up everywhere. While you may curse under your breath every time you step on a Lego, you don't have to suffer. Instead, buy a bin to place all your child's toys in. You will have them neatly placed off to the side, and when it's time to put everything away, make a game of it. 2. When looking to declutter and where to put your belongings, the answer can be right in front of you. Look at the space underneath your bed and the floor. This is a perfect space to put a few bins underneath. You can place blankets, winter coats, and even shoe bins and tuck them away. They are out of sight and packed away neatly. 3. It is easy to have your toothpaste, toothbrush, and tongue scraper scattered around the bathroom. With a silverware divider, you can help tidy up everything in your bathroom. This kind of storage is usually meant for the kitchen, but you can easily organize your bathroom as well with it. Tuck it in a drawer for easy access and a better way to tidy everything up. 4. Don't throw your towels just anywhere. In the bathroom, you can fasten baskets on the back of your doors. You can toss your towels in when you aren't using them. Tuck away guest towels and lotions this way. It's a DIY way to make everything look neat while cleverly storing your everyday bathroom items. 5. Hasn't it ever become a pain to keep your jewelry from not getting tangled? This can cause clutter and a lot of frustration, especially when you are trying to detangle your necklaces. Avoid this kind of frustration with a cork board and hang your jewelry from it. You will have decluttered your jewelry while also making each piece readily available when you feel like decorating yourself with it. 6. Your clothing drawer is most likely not the first place you'd want to go when decluttering your home. After all, it's not out for display, but you are most likely throwing your clothes in the drawer, which makes everything messy. You can't find certain clothes you want, you can't fit everything in the drawers, and you're making everything wrinkled. Place a divider in the drawer to help separate every item of clothing neatly. 7. Just like placing a plastic bin underneath the bed, place a plastic bin underneath the couch. Utilize that room. Whatever you want to still keep, but don't want it out in the living room, store away in a pin. You can slide it under the couch and no one will ever know it's there. 8. Floating shelves can help store and display anything. Instead of having your desk look a mess with pens, makeup brushes, and everything else, get a floating shelf. You will be able to separate your little items, which will declutter the mess. You can make your possessions neat and don't have to get rid of anything with some floating shelves. 9. It is a pain to maintain laundry. When it's time to do a load, you have to separate the whites from the colors. You have to make sure the items of clothing that can't go in the dryer don't and it's all just a big headache. By getting a heavy-duty laundry hamper, you can separate your clothing before it's laundry day and cut out the stress that goes along with it. 10. There are some really nice bed frames that have drawers already in them. You can easily have more storage and therefore make everything more organized with a bed and drawers. Get a stylish bed that looks good and put the drawers to good use. Get one of any size and color that you would like in order to match your room. 11. Organize your closet with a fabric closet organizer shelf. This addition to your closet allows you to choose different squares to hold different items. Place your sockets in one cubby hole, while the others are meant for your boxers, scarves, and anything else. Keep your clothing uniformed and easy to pick out when in a rush. 12. This is an incredibly easy trick to organize and declutter your apartment. Rather than having to look for your keys every day because you've tossed them somewhere, buy a new key rack. You will ensure that not only your keys will be the same place wherever you need them, but you're also doing away with the disorganized look of keys being flung all over the place. 13. 
Just like with keys, we tend to toss mail on the kitchen table when we come home. There's so many unnecessary letters coming in from the mail, and in an increasingly digital world, we have no use for letters. They're nuisances and a waste of paper. They also make your home look cluttered. With the mail rack on the wall, you have neatly put your mail aside for whenever you feel like looking through them. 14. By buying a closet organizer, you can make sure that you are structuring your belongings in your closet in a neat way. You don't need to throw shows aside or have boxes piling up with a closet organizer. Buy one of any size with however many tiers you need. Then, place what you want on it for a way to declutter your closet. 15. Instead of coming home and hanging your coat over the couch or even a chair, hang it on a coat rack. This may seem like a no-duh kind of moment, but there are plenty of people who don't factor in a coat rack when buying furniture for their apartment. By having clothes hanging on the couch or chairs, you are giving your apartment a messy look and feel. Get rid of that unappealing appearance by simply buying a basic coat rack. 16. A shoe cubby is almost the same idea as a coat rack. It is not something you think about until you're walking into your apartment and kicking off your shoes. You can have a pile of shoes that simply look messy and are a hazard as you trip on the pile. With a shoe cubby near the door, you have your shoes nicely organized. You can take any pair you want out or put the current pair you have in when you come home. Declutter the show pile with a cubby of any size. 17. Just like your kids enjoy playing with toys in the living room, they enjoy playing with toys in the bathroom. When it's time for a bath, it's easier to get kids excited for bath time with the help of rubber duckies and other water-friendly toys. Get a toy storage for the bathroom to store the bath time toys when they aren't using them. 18. An ottoman is a nice decorative piece for any room. Buy an ottoman bench that can be used for storage. Anything that you have lying around that you want to tuck away can be put into this bench. You don't even need to limit where one can go. Either buy one for your bedroom, living room, or both. Even placing one near the window of your kitchen adds a nice feel to the room while functioning as a decluttering savior. 19. Your coffee table is where you and your guests gather around during social visits. Why not utilize it? With a coffee table with shelves, you can store your remote controllers, magazines, and DVDs of favorite movies to watch with the girls. Don't let stuff pile up on top of a regular coffee table, when you can buy ones with shelves for optimizing space. 20. When you have all of your spices in your cabinets, you sometimes don't put them back in the neatest of fashion. Not only that, but the spice you do need always seems to be in the back. Now you have to take everything out just to find the oregano. With a spice rack, you are displaying your spices in an organized fashion. You will also be able to grab what you need easier. 21. What a neat little trick. While lounging on the couch, watching your favorite episode of Real Housewives, the last thing you want to do is get up. With a sofa armrest organizer, you can place your remote, your extra batteries, and more right in the pockets provided. Declutter with ease with this small organizer. 22. Just like your spices, we tend to simply shove our pots and pans in the cabinets of our kitchen when we are not using them. We tell ourselves that we're going to stack them properly, but even if we do it once, we often are too lazy to put everything back the way it was. This as for disorganization and clutter. Take all the hassle out of this, but hanging your pots and pans. 23. You don't have a lot of options when it comes to your bathroom space. This often makes bathrooms messy, as we are simply placing items wherever we can find them. This isn't a good look and embarrassing when you have guests over. By buying an over-the-toilet cabinet, you can neatly store away extra toilet paper and hand towels. Lotions and nail remover can also be stored away in these cabinets. 24. Add more space for storage with a kitchen counter organizer. Have your mugs, spices, oils, and more stacked neatly with one of these nifty tools. Your kitchen is a place where you cook the best meals for your family. You don't want it to get messy. Avoid having a messy kitchen with the counter organizer. 25. When trying to find storage, you have to think about anywhere and everywhere. 
That's why an undershelf basket is perfect. You can literally put it anywhere. It adds just a little extra room for sponges and other items that you would normally have just flung to the wayside. And that's all for now. What do you think about this episode? Please share your thoughts about this video in the comment section. For more apartment storage and organizing ideas, stay tuned to our channel. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.